What's up, YouTube? This video is brought to you by Weebull. If you'd like to help out the channel and get some free stock, make sure you check out my link below. Hey, I'm Chris saying in today's video is just another update as well as just some guidance on how to be playing certain situations in the stock market, guys. But hey, listen, if I helped y'all in any way, would I was help you make some money or give you a new perspective on the stock market, please make sure you like and subscribe and join us on the journey. Without further ado, let's take a look at my portfolio. Okay, guys, I'm back. Two videos in one day, but I just wanted to tap in and talk to the family momentarily, guys. Today, again, not too much to write home about, at least for me, in terms of kicking off this week in the stock market. However, when I talk to you about not too much to write home about, notice that the losses are minimum. I, I would call this a break even day, okay? So don't get it twisted. I'm just simply saying that again, nothing was, was again, nothing was too crazy in either direction, okay? That's what you want in your portfolio, but that comes with how you construct your portfolio, which we'll dive into just a little bit today, okay? Listen, guys, on today, I wanna to talk to you about a few things, primarily on building out your plays properly and the right way, especially taking advantage of weakness, okay? Let's look at one play in particular. Before we do that, ticker symbol AMC, just giving you guys my daily update on this specifically, okay? Right now, it's currently sitting at 41.28. It was down 77.75% 70, today and down another 3% after hours. You add that all up, that is down over 10%, okay? You check this out. Again, I always give you guys price targets. So if you are a new and or beginning investor and or new to this play and don't yet have a position, where would this go next? This is the support level for this stock from this area for this range is 40 39 okay you're gonna find some support in that area 37 38 so that whole range from 37 to 40 look for this to bob and weave from tomorrow may not go as far as 37 it might go to 38 or 39 but the point being is that's a range and a level of support in case you need to know where to get in at and then you ride it up intraday or if you hold long term then that's just what you do okay make your money ride the trend take advantage of the momentum but understand do you in this play the stock that i wanted to talk to you guys about today using as an example is palantir ticker symbol pltr currently sitting at $22.90, okay? Listen guys, on the journey, I told you, you gotta know the plays that you have high conviction in, okay? So when you are assessing your portfolio, yep, you're gonna have some rinky dink plays that you don't care too much about. You might've just bought just because. However, you need to also have plays you have high conviction in. First and foremost, you should only have no more than 10 stocks, okay? So survey your portfolio, see if you are spreading yourself thin, see are you holding too many plays? That's the number one thing that's weighing you down and heightening your risk exposure, okay? But number two, with a play like Palantir, check this out guys, it is down 1.46% on today. And so let's just look at this. It is down to 2290. Check out my average cost. I'm currently sitting in this at 2073. I really want this at 18 selfishly, okay? That's just me. So for me as an investor, I'm not tripping on this down day. What I'm saying is, man, this play didn't come down enough, okay? I want this at 18, but if it come to 2073, you guys see my average cost? I would buy more at 2073 because my average cost basis will go unchanged. However, I would load up the boat if this touches 19 or 18, okay? Because I already know what this play has the capability of doing. Number three, the number three thing I want to talk to you guys about is this. Last video I introduced it, but I'm going to introduce it and just sprinkle it in every conversation from this day forward until I think I got all, all 500,000 to 1 million of you on board with this. This year is different, guys, and that's something I want you guys to see, recognize, and understand, okay? And so, although I have no doubt in my mind that plays can double, I also know what we're up against, okay? And so if you're new to the game, you might not fully know all the catalysts that work against you, okay? So what I'm noticing is that while we are trying to hold for 
a hundred percent return, which is cool and all, but you got to have the right kind of conditions to pull that off. Okay. We are getting burned holding too long. We got just like this, we have 10%. I'm not saying that's much to write home about, but if I went through the rest of my portfolio, you would see we up 30%, 40%, 50%. Matter of fact, just for sport, we can go ahead and do it. Check out NEO, okay? We're up 157%. We don't need to be holding plays up 157%. Point being, guys, we could be taking profit at 40%, 60%. This is what's tripping us up, in my opinion, honestly, in my honest opinion, we're holding our plays for too long when we could be accepting a 40% win, but instead we're holding out for the double up and then a correction come, a crash come, a pullback come. This company want to do a share offering. All the things that hurts us. It's not the plays, it's the things that's happening around the plays that's again killing the vitality this particular year okay when you bounce back off of a again a recession or a crash like we had due to COVID, it's to be expected but you could never this market just been weird guys and i'll be the first to tell you if we're not navigating it the right way if you're not in and out of your place again it's going to be a bumpy ride you're going to have more frowns on your face than smiles on your face, okay? Long-term plays has to be long-term plays such as your Apples, your Amazon, Facebooks. But then guys, you have to have your plays like this, your plays like Palantir as the plays you are in shorter term if they are for real not a long-term play for you. Meaning when you're up 50, 60%, go ahead and lock in that profit because if you don't lock in your profit and put your stop loss on, guess what? they're more than likely to fall 60, 70, 80% soon as the next correction hit. And we don't want that. Listen guys, up next is our word of the day and our word of the day is adjustments. Again, guys, I wanted to talk about some of the adjustments you have to make on your journey, okay? There's no such thing as easy street. There's no such thing as a free ride. You are going to have some bumps and bruises. You're gonna have some lessons learned and I want you guys to understand, more importantly, embrace it. I'm an athlete, so I see it and I just go, I, get, I go crazy, I get hype. I see it as an opportunity to compete, okay? I'm looking like, okay, they doing this. Okay, Wall Street is playing retail traders like this. Okay, we need to do this as opposed to, bowing down and crumbling and crying and complaining okay and i'm not saying that's what nobody's doing i'm just saying how i see it yep this year they're manipulating our play they're shorting all of our plays specifically okay and so with that you're not going to cry over spilled milk you're going to look at a way to combat it that's what i've done my whole life i have beat the system i've beat everything they set up to keep a young black guy from the inner city down i've superseded everything and Again, live a life that you only read about in the history books, okay? But check this out, man. You want to be able to adjust and pivot, okay? And in our case, I'm proposing we need to hold our plays a little shorter term, okay? Yes, the double up is what will normally be the case, but this year we might have to settle for 60%, 75%, okay? Some plays will be 50% or 40%, okay? Just so that we can better navigate get in get out move on and continue to trash higher okay let me know if you guys are with me guys listen we make videos like this every day remember most people see the end result very few consider the journey do me a favor don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel make sure you guys grab some free stock using my link below and i'll see you all in the next one